All right, so here we are. Just a little slice of Northern Ontario living. Just gone out, harvested some black stone. That was the sand pit where I've been getting all my sand for the construction. But just so you get an idea of how rough the road is. Do you hear that? It almost sounds like China or dishes rattling in the back. That's this black stone that I've been collecting. It's uh, very interesting. It, it often sounds like somewhere in the neighborhood of Flint to me. But there you have it. Now it sounds like China. I feel like I'm transporting some dishes. But I'm not. So you wonder, like, okay, so why is this road here, this road to nowhere? Well, predominantly, it's industry. It's gravel, gravel pits, and it's forestry. It's wood, trees, lumber, pulp and paper, a lot of that, a lot of, a lot of tree harvesting. So, industry, I mean, some people, you know, oh, meh, 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 meh. big business, big forestry, yeah, yeah, there's probably some not the greatest practices going on in the business. One of those practices would be yeah, just a sec here, we're hitting a Really rough spot. I've got a good load, maybe seven, eight hundred pounds today. It's a little less than normal. Full gravel run is probably closer to 900 pounds. So, the forestry industry, with all its flaws, opened up these roads. And now I can access gravel and sand. Tons of people are camping, they're going out under ATV, so I mean it opens things up. But on the downside, a couple of years back when I phoned all the various government authorities asking where could this particular Canadian citizen harvest a tree. I want to do some woodworking, I want to do a project, just a couple of trees maybe. Nope. Nope. All the rights for, I don't know how far around, they're all, uh, uh, they're not purchased so much as, what did the government call them? Something like cooperative or steward or whatever. So the government sells these giant parcels of land, forestry rights. And I, the bottom line was that the government told me that I would need to approach the local private industry, right? The local business that has purchased the rights to harvest these trees. So it seems a little weird, you know? Canadian citizen going hand, hat in hand. Please, sir, may I have a tree? And apparently that business has the right to charge me for these trees. How interesting. But here we have the open road because of these things. This is Robert Ross signing off from Northern Ontario. Peace and out.